Hi everyone, it's me, JP, and I'm here in my uh, apartment. It's uh, about 5 o'clock on Saturday, August 2nd, 2008, and I'm taking my before shot. So this is a before shot. You ready? Before. Hi everyone, it's Sunday, August 3rd. Um, so this is the after picture. So yesterday I had a <clears throat> laser eye surgery and uh, this is the result. Uh, right now my vision is pretty good. It's pretty perfect. I can read everything. I can see everything. Um, it's still a little bit cloudy because my corneas, you know, they have to heal. They have to mend together and everything. But pretty much uh, it's pretty good. I'm happy with it. So here's what happened. I was in Pudong and I was cleaning my glasses off on my shirt and the rim just busted, okay? The lens fell off and hit the, hit the pavement and it chipped on the side and the, the rim was busted in a place where it shouldn't be busted. So I was like, oh, I have to get laser eye surgery. And um, I went on the web to see, you know, where it was here in Shanghai. And I realized that Shanghai is a destination for laser eye surgery for uh, people, you know, like Japanese people and Taiwanese people that want a, a discount rate. So just like maybe in the US we would go to Mexico or Canada for a discount rate, people are coming to Shanghai. So I'm like, geez, I'm living in a discount rate LASIK city. So I made an appointment and uh, to my surprise, the doctor was Filipina. They were, they were like, oh, this doctor can speak English. So I was like, okay, uh, great. But I walked in and she's Filipina. She's like, are you Filipino? I said, yes, sweet. So, uh, so the doctor, of course, hit and I hit it off really well. And uh, she did a number of tests on me. Well, her nurses did a number of tests on me and we realized that I was a good candidate. And I said, doctor, can you give me the Kabayan discount? And she said, yeah, well, you email me directly when you want to schedule, right? So I emailed her directly and she said, okay, I can get you a Kabayan discount. So um, I got a big discount. So yesterday I showed up to the eye hospital. It was a, the clinic where they performed the surgery and uh, they were waiting for the other doctor because my Filipina doctor was not actually performing it. She was assisting. It was, uh, it's actually, um, a Chinese doctor who was, you know, I think he's like a professor in the Chinese university. He's like a little bit more qualified. So he was a doctor that actually ran the LASIK machine. So uh, anyway, it was cool. They took a long time. Actually, they took two hours to go over my data. You know, you, they did a lot of measurements and they took an unexpected long, an, an unexpectedly long time to go over my data. Um, but when they were ready for me, it was time to go in. Um, there were a few China moments. Okay, so these are the China moments. One is that they washed my eyes off, right? They didn't use a sink, right? They used this little, they, they uh, had a drip of water that was hanging on one of those IV stands. And they just, I was just sitting there on the examination table and they, and they washed it, right? But of course, you know, there were like five people there because it's China, right? And they can hire a lot of nurses. There were five people like, you know, guarding my face so that it wouldn't get wet, you know, just so that only my eye would be washed. And, um, okay, so they washed my eye, but part of washing my eye was sticking cotton in my ears, right? So they were sticking cotton in my ears so that the water wouldn't, you know, get into my ears and stuff like that, or they could just pull it out later. But they left the cotton in my ears during the procedure and, you know, during the whole follow-up to the procedure. So they would ask me stuff and they knew I spoke English, so they were trying out their English on me, the nurses. And so they were like asking me stuff in English, but of course they're, by this time they were wearing surgical masks. So they asked me this stuff, <laughs> right? Because they're shy to speak English. They have surgical masks on. Oh, and there's cotton in my ears. When I didn't understand what they said, because they said, <laughs> they like looked around and they switched to Chinese. They tried to tell me in Chinese. <laughs> Chinese, I still don't understand, right? Uh, that was kind of a China moment. Another China moment was when I was under the, when I was in the LASIK machine and the doctor, I think the doctor was getting frustrated because my eye kept moving. So the lasers kept shutting down, right? Because the lasers know when you're moving, they're like, it's over, right? 
So the doctor was like, after the third or fourth time they were shutting down, the doctor was like, don't move, don't move, don't move. And you know, it's really hard not to move because you focus and your focus drifts and you, ooh, you gotta focus back and you moved, right? Anyway, so the doctor was like, look to right, look to right. And okay, so I'm thinking, look to right. So doctor, are you saying look to the right or look to the light? And he says, yes, look to right. And so I said, okay. And he said, no, 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 look to right, look to right. I was like, okay, look to the light. Got it. That's my RL moment in China. Other than that, the procedure was pretty okay. It was a little bit more traumatic than I thought it was going to be, um, you know, when they were slicing part of my eyeball off and um, trying to focus on the laser. That was painless. It kind of smelled funny. But then when they put the cornea back in, it, you know, everything was clear for a second. And then, uh, so now everything's clear. Uh, everything has a little bit of a halo around it, just because you know my corneas are still my cornea is still mending back into my eyeball. But otherwise, it's pretty good. Oh, last night it kind of hurt. Last night was a little bit painful. Um, like I wish they had given me some nun drops because I felt like there were staples in my eyes. But I was like, oh, I just get through it. But it's already feeling better today. A uh, little bit itchy feeling, a little bit feeling like there's something you know foreign in my eyeballs. But it's pretty okay. Pretty okay. It was a pretty good experience for the Kabayan price. Anyway, that's uh, my story about laser eye surgery. Ooh.